Hi, Kayla Hill here, and this is the Innovative Campaign Research Presentation for Be Is For Brand, a strategic branding and digital marketing company based in Portland, Oregon. Continual research into marketing campaign innovation is a key aspect to a marketer's approach to their work. This presentation will discuss the current dominant types of innovative campaigns with a selection of the three most innovative discovered during the research process. Last, the application of the selected campaigns, as could be applied to Be's internet marketing campaign, will be explored. Here are the most dominant innovative campaign types and some of the common threads discovered with each. The three types discussed in this presentation are combinations of all of the above. The first campaign is part of Disney's made-for-TV movie, Zombies. Here is a video clip explanation of their campaign. Disney's app, Disney Now, contains a live play feature that allows viewers to interact with the show and their characters by having an on-screen overlay that is synced with the app. It offers the opportunity to guess what the characters will sing, scavenger hunts, and to rate the emotional factor of their favorite characters. The votes appear live time on screen. Viewers can also see how well they're doing in relation to other contestants on the leaderboard in the app. This campaign took typical television viewer engagement to the next level. The second campaign was created around a surprise product placement of Eggo Waffles in Netflix series Stranger Things. According to an article from H.B. Duran on the website A-List, in the 30 days before the launch of Season 2, this pairing earned Eggo over 200000 in earned media. Earned media is the engagement value a brand obtains for its marketing efforts across channels. Here's a video clip from the opening of Season 2. Eggo Waffles were the favorite food of a lead character named Eleven, played by Millie Bobby Brown. Eleven is a young girl with special powers who had been estranged from society her whole life. Ego did not know their product would be featured in the first season of the popular show, but the partnership was embraced, as is evidenced here in this clip. In preparation for the launch of season two, Ego created multiple campaigns across multiple channels to promote the affiliation. The brand created principal downloads for Halloween costumes, incorporating the 80s version of Ego boxes for Eleven inspired outfits. This was done by the agency CRISPR of Eidelman. The same agency also created nine Ego-inspired recipes titled after each episode of Season 2, which were available online through Pinterest and multiple articles. Samples of the recipes were handed out from their 80s-style Ego waffle truck used at the Season 2 launch of Stranger Things. Agencies BML and Leo Burnett worked together to develop and market a spoiler blocker plugin for Stranger Things fans on Google Chrome. Waffles with a branded toaster were sent to influencers with the title, Mornings Are for Ego and Contemplation, a take on a season one line from actor Jim Hopper, Mornings Are for Coffee and Contemplation. One innovative YouTube Ego influencer, Jay Steele, even made a Stranger Things title sequence recreated with Ego Waffles. Innovation doesn't always require a large budget. Kentucky Fried Chicken, KFC, has touted their secret recipe of 11 herbs and spices for decades. Their umbrella company, White & Kennedy, followed 11 and only 11 Twitter profiles with KFC's corporate profile. They were each of the five Spice Girls and six guys named Herb. It took a month before a fan noticed and called them out on the social media platform, gaining 700,000 favorites and 300,000 comments from the single post. White & Kennedy sent the follower a painted portrait of him being carried on Colonel Sanders' back. The KFC campaign was innovative and creative by using an existing platform with a novel twist. Ego's campaign was prolific and particularly innovative with the development of the spoiler blocker for Google Chrome. However, Disney's large budget allowed for the greatest innovation in regard to advancements with integration of new technology and a traditional channel, television. In addition, they broke the barrier for online audience engagements and interaction timed with the premiere showing. When it comes to implementing any of these strategies into Bias for Brands' internet marketing plan, Disney's approach to engagement is the most compelling. Creating a video for viewers to interact with and hosting through YouTube could inspire interactivity and engagement. Like the Ego and Stranger Things campaign, the use of influencers and a multi-channel approach is something B is already intending to do. The KFC campaign is a bit trickier to emulate as it was pure creative cleverness. This is something B strives for, always, and the campaign can serve as a reminder to think outside the box, or bucket. Thank you for listening to my presentation. Have a great day.